Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Today's video is going to be just a tutorial or just going to help you fix a common error that some people face when they go to the Steam library, click on DDS. Uh, when they click play, the game just doesn't launch up. It uh, just opens up and just crashes instantly. Uh, today I will show you how to fix it. Very simple and easy, just have to follow a few steps so to go to the uh, saves folder just hold the uh, windows key and uh, press r this will pop up and you just type in here uh, percentage local app data percentage because this is a hidden folder you can't access it from the explorer press ok or enter and you will see this pop up then just scroll down until you find drug dealer simulator without spaces open it go to saved uh, ignore all this except for config this is your saves games uh, saves games and uh, serialized folders folders have your save game uh, slots uh, open up config file uh, windows no editor and uh, here you will find all these uh, config uh, config uh, or .cfg files uh, we want the game user setting this one game user setting right click open with notepad don't use anything else or you might just not uh, have it work uh, correctly just use notepad and uh, you see this pop up next up you're just go um, just uh, making it bigger so you can see better uh, you just have to make sure uh, that some of these settings are uh, disabled or enabled and you want to uh, just fix it up basically First thing you want to do is uh, look under the scalability groups, uh, resolution quality. Make sure it is a hundred, and uh, leave anything of uh, after the this little dot. Just leave it as it is. Uh, six zeros. Uh, sometimes you can find just six five, one, any random numbers. Make sure it is one hundred uh, dot whatever the rest. Just leave it uh, alone. These are your uh, normal graphic settings. So, uh, you can tinker with these, you can leave them or whatever. The three is highest and zero or one is lowest. Uh, then you want to scroll down and uh, make sure uh, uh, V-Sync uh, doesn't matter. Dynamic resolution should be false. Uh, your resolution uh, X and Y should be your native resolution. Uh, it is not for me right now because uh, uh, I do alt and enter a lot to toggle between uh, full screen and uh, on and off so it just gets confused should be 1920 by 1080 all these as well just switch them all to your native resolution and uh, make sure the full screen mode is set to zero so it does not go into full screen that's the main thing that causes your crash uh, I did uh, fix this myself, uh, it happened to be about a month or two ago, can't really remember, but this is how it fixed, and I uh, just fixed, uh, fixed it for something, for someone else as well, so I decided to make this a uh, fix uh, video, so y'all can just uh, fix it real quick. Next up, just make sure every full screen mode setting is set to zero, you can change, uh, change that later uh, from the game setting keep the version or the quality level doesn't matter uh, frame rate doesn't matter either you can have it set to uh, even a thousand so it's not capped uh, by the way if you set it to zero it will go back to capping at 60 fps um, desired uh, skin width 1920 false 1080p uh, 1920 just switch every resolution sh setting to your native resolution from your screen recommended whatever just keep it like this uh, minus one doesn't matter uh, then go to uh, maybe you should just make this uh, what I just think of it don't touch don't touch this and this until you uh, try with the other settings then H HDR doesn't matter uh, use HDR display output make sure it's false because uh, if you have HDR just use it I guess doesn't matter for now just make sure it's false so to make sure it doesn't uh, affect all the settings raw input doesn't matter that's for your mouse and uh, yeah that's about it just click uh, control s to save it or just click on file save then just close it 
and uh, yeah just go back to your steam library dds and play and it should work like this see it's not in full screen mode because if it was it would go uh, everything would go to black the monitor would turn off for a second and just come back in in uh, 1080p uh, on full screen mode now i can just uh, use my uh, show my taskbar using the windows key i think yeah you can see my actual uh, the cursor of my windows uh, over the uh, game cursor and when i click back into the game you can hear this huh? yeah that's how you make sure you can also uh, press alt and enter to get out of this mode and uh, yeah it should work flawlessly from now on if this uh, does not work then make sure it's uh, the game is updated your graphic drives and all that you all know how it goes and uh, it should work if it doesn't then i don't really know what to do uh, this worked so i guess uh, that's how we do it and uh, if you have a uh, cpu that's an 11th generation cpu like i9 11900k or whatever uh, any 11 then three numbers and the uh, CPU y there's a video that uh, explains how to fix the game for this uh, for your CPU because the game does not work with the 11th gen CPUs I will leave a link in the description so if that's the case then go watch that one and uh, if uh, this fix worked uh, make sure to like the video subscribe for to never miss an upload and uh, yeah I'll see you next time